neuro-linguistic programming uh, came out of the work that I did modeling the way people thought. We, we, it, what we did is so new, unique. Uh, when I started out, there were 40 schools of psychotherapy all arguing about who had the right approach when none of them could reliably do a single thing. You know, they couldn't fix phobias, they couldn't do this, they couldn't do that. Every once in a while they were successful, but most of the time they were so busy arguing about the theories. What I started looking at was the natural process by which people make mental changes. We looked at the neurological configurations, we looked at the linguistic structures that are hardwired in the mind, and found out about how people learn. And so that people could be able, just like you program a computer, to program yourself to be able to do things. We can reliably get rid of a phobia in 10 minutes every single time. Because we found out, not by studying people that had phobias, but by studying people who had gotten over phobias and finding out how they did it. What they did at the neurological level and at the subjective level. Neurolinguistic programming is the study of the structure of subjectivity the way in which we make pictures, where they're located, how big they are, where we locate our voices, and how we alter our feelings, of what are called emotional states, whether they rotate this way or this way. All of those little details give you a set of tools that, by which people can make absolutely profound changes easily and quickly.